Before we break for coffee. Yeah, and thanks for taking up my entire slot, um, but I'll try and get it <laughs> done as quickly as possible. Okay, so um, this year there's going to be a huge big focus on the Harcourt Academy. So as I said, not as exciting, I suppose, as marketing, but if we don't have agents that are able to do the basics, etc., um, any amount of marketing or creating virtual agents or, stuff or whatever is a bit pointless. So it all starts here. So um, just a thing, our purpose is to grow our people, to lift performance, and we believe that earning, I mean, sorry, learning is instrumental to success. So we need to make sure that our agents are being upskilled all the time, and as I said, a big focus for us this year. Um, I'm sure that you all are avid hub supporters and you're going on to the hub every day to see what is new and what's available. So the hub is really being used extensively now to, to put our academy offering together. So what we're wanting to see is a, a, a far more streamlined learning process. It's going to be a learning path for new agents. I think that's going to sort of help you guys take a lot of the pressure off when we were talking about putting together an induction program and that sort of thing, we're gonna hopefully take a lot of that pain away by creating these learning paths for your new agents. And then it's also going to be a library of training material. So that's where we see the hub going. And as I said, it's what we are working on at the moment. So for those of you who don't go onto the hub that often and you don't know what we have, this is what is current, okay? and I think it's going to be added on to because AJ is working on a whole lot of stuff at the moment. We've got a lot of stuff on marketing. So marketing and social media, we've got loads of training videos, so direct your agents there, they can find out about TikTok. We've got non-negotiable social media skills, digital marketing content, how to do agent profiling, and getting serious about video marketing. So that is all available, and your, your teams can go on and Go ahead. I'm talking too loudly. I'm no, no, too just off. Oh, okay. Oh, sorry. That's unusual for me. Um, okay, so lots of stuff on marketing and social media. We've got a lot of tech training as well, and that's been uh, added onto all the time. So we've got all of our tech training videos. If you've got new agents who don't know how to use Pop Data, we just go onto the hub and we direct them to the Pop Data user training. We can teach them how to use Quickly Sign. There's a whole lot of training on Flow. And as I said, that is something that's going to be added onto um, as and when changes happen on top data, etc. So you need to keep an eye on the hub. We've got rental training currently, which is rental prospecting. Last year we did a three-part training session with Sean Late, and that is loaded onto the hub. So if you've got rental agents, they can go and um, have a watch and listen there. And then we've got sales training, and we are going to be adding to this extensively. We've got a lot of training for new agents, but we understand that we are needing to sort of upskill um, our more experienced agents, so we're working on that service offering. But currently we've got enough stuff to keep them entertained, prospecting and lead generating, winning the mandate, business planning, art of negotiation, lots of scripts and dialogues. Go and dig around on the hub and you'll find it all there. Then, my absolute favorite, <laughs> sales the Harcourt's way, that is now available on the hub. So if I'm not doing it live, which I will continue to be doing it, probably on a bi-monthly basis only, because there's a lot of other stuff that is coming um, that we are busy with, um, they can then do it on demand. If you go onto the hub, you go under learning, you'll see all six modules there, and they can, and they can get started. Um, they are just recordings of sessions we've done before, but I've had some really nice feedback. I had an agent phone me yesterday and said, we're looking so forward to meeting you in person, just did session one of the training videos, and they absolutely loved it. So yeah, you can send your agents there if I'm not doing a live one. So that sells a half its way, and we've got auction training. So this wonderful auction platform, if you have got agents that are wanting to embrace auction and use that as a method of selling, they just need to log onto the hub and go and do the auction training. It's a great non-module, modulated learning um, process. Um, they have to work through it, and once they've finished it, they'll get that sort of completion thing. You as the business owner should be getting that as well. As I say, lots of training videos, downloadable so um, supporting documents, things about um, handling the listing presentation, trying to get that auction mindset, um, dealing with your buyers and sellers, um, etc. So that's a very nice offering. 
And then <laughs> my all time absolute favorite, <clears throat> they just of training, which has caused a lot of gray hairs and aging prematurely. So that is still available. We are doing intern logbook um, for probably four times a year. If the need arises or we need to add an extra one, I'll do that. But that is five sessions and uh, I get your intern agents through that whole logbook process. The RPL MQF4 course, we're currently busy with one. The next one will be starting in May. We're gonna do three of those through this year. And then the, if we actually need to have PDE prep workshops, seeing that now everybody can just download it, <laughs> Google um, while they're doing it, we are going to still be doing um, a PDE prep workshop one month prior to each of the exams. So um, somebody asked me for some sort of clarity on the new um, PDE exam and the format. And yes, as what you, know, you asked me is exactly correct. They are going to be sent the PDE exam. Um, they'll be able to download it. It's gonna be emailed to them. They then have eight hours to complete it using any uh, channels that you want to, you can go and Google, uh, probably chat GPT, but change it slightly. You can get an entire panel of people to assist you. And once you've finished it, you just upload it and email it back to them. So that's the new PDE exam. Yeah. Yeah. You see, I mean, there are two ways of thinking of it. It is actually quite amazing because there are a lot of you that have been really battling to get some of your agents through the PDE process. Cheryl, Ronnie, and you'll be able to get them qualified. Anyway, so, so that is legislative training. <laughs> Please make sure that you look and um, have a look at the monthly training uh, academy calendar. Um, it will then give you the overview of what is available the coming month, and you can get everyone prepared for that. My favorite thing is when I start something like logbook training on the second of the month, and on the ninth of the month, somebody says, when are you doing your next logbook training? And we're like, it's on the second. But if you have a look at the calendar, then you'll be able to be well prepared for that. So that's the monthly calendar. Then, what's new? So, first thing that is new is our new rental course. So we introduced you to Sean late yesterday. If you didn't know him, he's from Rental Sphere. We did that training course with him uh, last year, and we are still going to be doing ad hoc training for the more experienced rental agents, but we did know that there was a definite gap in our training offering. Um, we get our sales agents ready, but we're not getting our rental agents ready. So this is basically what this course is. Um, about. Uh, you'll be able to find it on the hub. Your agents can log on, register to do the course. And again, it's a modulated course. I think there are about 18 modules and they'll need to finish all 18 of them. Once they finish, they'll get a certificate, but it's the real fundamentals. So they go th he goes through things like legislation, prospecting, understanding that mandate, just a great sort of broad overview of, of rentals. So a nice um, offering there. I would get some of your more experienced agents to go and do it as well. Mm. They definitely don't all do things right. <laughs> so that is one of the new ones that we have coming. I mean, that is current. And then a couple of things that we have coming soon. So we're busy working on this. One of them is material for in-house training. So a lot of this we're going to be putting together for you guys. We know that a lot of you guys have training days and sometimes you battle for material, what are we gonna train our agents on this week or whatever it is. So we're gonna create a library and that is going to have information there for you. So agents won't have access to this, but it's going to be, we're gonna to put together um, facilitator guides, the slideshow, um, and sort of any handouts that you might need to use to go along with the course. And these are the current ones that we're gonna be working on, defending your commission, winning, and managing mandates, marketing and personal promotion, prospecting and lead generation, becoming an area specialist in the Harcourt's Promise. So that is, that's gonna be material that's gonna be available to you. Um, this is another one that I'm working on at the moment, the fundamentals of real estate, because one of the things that when an agent starts, we put them on sales the Harcourt's way. So we're showing them how to market, how to become area specialists, how to work with buyers and sellers, but who's, do they know anything about the code of conduct or about real estate product mix or, or anything to do with the absolute fundamentals? So this is going to be, they're probably going to be uh, sort of five or six modules. They're going to be short training videos 
and your agent should be doing it as a prequel to sales the half or sway. So it's really going to be, I suppose, when we did the, the old EAB exam, so a lot of that stuff that you've actually learned before going out there and doing the job, which we don't seem to do these days, they'll be able to do that. So look out for that. We'll do things like explaining contracts. We might get some external people to come and assist with with um, contract law or whatever it is, but we're working on that at the moment. Um, another nice one is half orts and you. We had decided as a corporate team that we wanted to put together something that was an introduction. So whether somebody's joining as a, an admin person or a new agent or whatever it is, we wanted them to have some sort of overview of what half orts is. And then Richard went to Australia and they're busy putting together a whole new one there, but we want to make this very much more our thing. Mm. So it's again going to be something that's on Zoom um, and it's going to be an introduction to us. Meet the team, who do they need to uh, speak to from a head office point of view, if they need anything done, our values and purpose, a nice high level overview of our tech platform. We'll definitely introduce them to the hub because we want them to be going there regularly to find out what's new and happening. And then our policies and procedures, etc. So just a nice overview of who we are and what we do. Our next one coming up is long overdue, but you know, no, no, no pressure, no pressure. This at all. Um, and we handed this one over to Corvus. Um, we did Ching Chong Cha and he lost, and now that's his baby. So this is something that we, I think we've sort of played around or tossed around for years coming up with a commercial industrial training course. It's very difficult because it's very specialized. It's definitely not like you're a sales agent and now suddenly you can become a really great commercial or industrial agent. So we are doing, I just use that royal we, Corvus, is gathering information from a lot of leading experts and all the rest of it. And we're going to be putting together a comprehensive training course, Corvus Comprehensive Training Course. Thank you, thank you. On all you. aspects of commercial and industrial <laughs> sales and rentals. Yeah, so, so look out for that. And masterclasses and in-office training. So thanks to some of you that, that answered the questionnaire that Richard sent out a couple of months ago about what kind of training do you want to see. We've kind of taken a big step back from doing masterclasses and in-office training because a lot of it is now happening over Zoom. But we do understand that needs have changed and some of your offices want to see more training happening in your office or in your region. So we are going to be rolling out a, a, a lot of that, depending on areas. I know Western Cape love masterclasses. KZN hate masterclasses. I literally have to pay the business owners to get their agents there. Um, so depending on the regions, we'll be doing masterclasses and in-office training. So again, just speak to your BDM, speak to me if you have any training needs in your offices, and let's see what we can um, work around there. And then just... A learning path as I said quite a nice thing if you've got new agents starting they need to go on some sort of training path um, so first thing which is quite important is apply for the FFC because I have so many agents that are even starting logbook and they don't even know what an FFC is I roll for the, enroll for the real estate fundamental course which should be the next step then do sales to Harcourt's way attend a Harcourt's a new session so they know who we are and what we do begin their intern logbook upskill with the hub based training courses because there's so much there that they can add on to after watching sales of half its way they can then begin the um, rpl mqf4 just remember that they have to have been in the industry and have done their logbook before they can start an rpl because it's actually recognition of prior learning once they are competent there they write the pd exam and we have some full status agents so that is pretty much the learning path we want new agents to follow when they join us and that is that. Any questions, complaints, comments, anything? Thank you. Thank you. No questions. No questions. Does everyone know exactly what's happening? Fantastic. Okay. Okay. Awesome. So now we're going to take up. Are we having a yeah. shorter tea bag because of AJ taking up all of our time? Right? Back at back at ten thirty-five. Okay. Back AJ at ten. Is he sorry? Um, at ten thirty-five. Back here. Ten thirty-five. Twenty minutes. Okay. Awesome. Thanks, guys.